What up, people? Ren the Legend here. Welcome back to 80s Mania Wrestling Returns. Let's go. Last month was a bit of a sad one. It was a bit of a sad one. Because Dicky Thunderbird, who was really trying to get him, get him to the world title, he got demolished in an Iron Man match. I'm talking demolished, people. He got a whooping. We do have a brand new TV champion here, Terry Van Winkle. So we'll see what we can do with him. Bonus segment if required. Let's book this first. Realistically, it should be flawless, and you know exactly what they're going to do. They're going to give us some grief for having a rematch, but, I mean, how could you not have that? Oh, I didn't realise they, they had a feud. Let's go. And it's for the actual belt. Oh, oh, it was a triple threat match, so that's fine. Okay, it was a triple threat, so we, we don't have any uh, issues there. Ladies match, mid-carders match, openers match. Right. I'm sorry, this ladies one. Top contenders is kind of hard. Spunky has just uh, failed. Shipley and Gothica. We can go with that, I think. We can go with Shipley, uh, Shipley and Gothica. Let's go. Put you in there. This is uh, a cruiserweight classic month. So we're going to have the cruiserweight tournament. So I think we will use our bonus segment to have a cruiserweight only match. I I think is probably the best thing to do. Mid carders only. We haven't done much with Blitz, so let's get Blitz in there. We haven't done much with Chameleon, actually. I should probably do a bit more. We're going to give Iron Mask a, a match here. Alright, we'll see if any of those can spark anything. Nice little run. Openers match. Um, we, we used Pat. He's, he's been okay. Where's Pat gone? Oh, he's injured. He must be injured. Right, in that case, Soul Daddy is always a solid choice for an open match. Uh, and I'll, I'll, how could you not be Chet? How could you not be Chet? Right, so that will do there. Uh, we have a single skit. Uh, contract signing, athlete. All right, let's do that. We haven't done uh, we haven't done one of those. Let's have a look. Athletes. Who do we have? Uh, Magnus, one hundred percent. There we go. You know, that's, a, that's actually a match, you know. That's actually a match. Athlete. Magnus and Slugger is a match, people. I've never had these two, like, paired up before. Uh, Pop. We're just going to do it for the bonus only. Take no, uh, take no notice of the spider in the promo. Alright, don't worry about it. <laughs> don't worry about it. Right. Now let's go with a, John, let's go with a triple threat. Let's go with a triple threat. We are going to have a bunch of cruiserweights. Let's go cruiserweight division. Arizona, do we really want him down there? I don't know. Devin. One of our better cruiserweights. Good history as well. 100% um, we're going to have a comedian kid because he needs to do more. We need to get him involved more. Uh, let's have a look at what else we've got. Magna has not long lost the title. Uh, Piranha. That'll do. Let's just get some bodies in there, see if someone stands up. Uh, venue, we're going to go with Canada. Yes. And then merch, we're going to merch it up. So we need to keep a, a very good eye on cruiserweights this, this month. So let's have a look. So Devin. Devin's helped the cruiserweight title a few times, I'm almost certain. Piranha always does well, and I'm pretty sure is a former champion. And then you've got Chameleon. Oh, okay. It's actually Chameleon's first year with us. The first time he's been drafted. Uh, Soul Daddy and Chet. Chet, another cruiserweight. So a win here would be big for Chet. There you go. Right, Chameleon 100% has to be in the tournament after that triple threat win, I think. Uh, Slugger and Magnus. Even though Slugger is a cruiserweight and is a staple of our cruiserweight division. I quite like the idea of those two having the match. Uh, Blitz versus Iron. Both of them have been neglected. This this is an opportunity for them. Okay, Blitz. All right. Next year, I think I'm going to turn Slugger face. Him and Blitz have a tag team run. But that's for next year. We don't have to wait the year. I don't have to wait the year. We'll see what happens. Gothica. While I'm rambling, Gothica. Big win. Here we go. TV title match. Terry versus Flawless. This could be a nice feud for a little while, you know. Terry wins the triple threat. Flawless had a great run with the belt. Terry keeps it, but we're going to come back to that. 
We're gonna come back to that. Four star people. Oh damn! Very, very happy with uh, Chameleon. Chet did well. Slugger and Magnus were definitely gonna visit. And then a beautiful intercontinental TV title match, people. Right, the Cruiserweight Champion. During Cruiserweight Classic Month. What do we do with him? What do we do with him? Uh, it's saying Dickie and Magna. I think... I keep saying Magna is Manga. Manga, Magna. <laughs> Ignore me. Right, Magna. Uh, lost the title. Slugger hasn't defended it yet, so let's give... Let's, let's do the rematch. I think that's the right thing to do. As you can see here, Devin is a big part. Um, Zen had a long reign, but we're trying to keep him in the world picture for now. Warhawk, Piranha, a two-time champion, Thunderbird. And then if we actually look at the Cruiserweight Cup, it's Devin, Dickey, and Piranha. So let's say those three are, are a must. The loser of the world title is a must. I say world title, cruiserweight title. You know what I'm saying. They're a must. So, all right, let's... let's um, mm -hmm. Right. So, the rematch first. Dickie. Right. We'll put Dickie in now. I mean, Dickie... He's in a bit of a weird place. He, he, he got... He got mauled. Let's say that. He got mauled. During the world title match. Uh, here we can't use Max and Zen. The Van Winkles are busy. They're very busy, so we're gonna have to go look at. Definitely want Toxic Terrors back in the mix. So let's find them. All my peoples, let's get them back. And then, who else are we gonna go with? Uh, it's Cruiser Week month, so we could put them in the division. But you know what? Let's, let's, let's give them a shot. Let's give them a shot. Let's do that. That's cool. Happy days. Mike Spot, Skit, and a one on one match. One on one, again, I think. Do we do Magnus? No, we can't do because Slugger's in the world title. The Cruiserweight title match. Um, let's go for some more Cruiserweights. This is a Cruiserweight month. I don't want to neglect everyone totally, but it's a Cruiserweight kind of month. We'll throw Dickie in there. He needs, he needs a bounce back win. That's what he needs. Uh, Cobra. You know it's going to be a good match. That's the important thing. It's going to be a good match. Should be a dicky win as well. So that would solve two problems. Um, Mike Spot. We'll just go with the normal. We always do. Uh, champion has not had much to do. So let's put him in there. 15 on the mic. That's fine. And we'll get a two booster on the mic. Two booster. Someone's got a two. You're in the two. And then for Skit. We can go with Gothica. She's built herself up a little bit, so we can do a creepy vignette with our, our resident Ghouli Gothica. Let's put you in there. We need someone with a pop bonus of two. You will do. And we're not going to use our bonus segment. We're just going to go straight in. That is good. And then it's going to be Chicago. Nice, and go! Beautiful. Dicky needs a win. If Johnny wins here, I don't know what the hell we're going to do with Dicky. It had to be. It had to be a Thunderbird win. I really, really wanted him to get that world title, but it is what it is. What are you going to do? What are you going to do? Gothica? <laughs> she, she has to be the... Uh, she has to be next in line for the women's, the women's title, I think. Or certainly up there. Toxic Terrors, American Heroes, who haven't had much of a run. Toxic Terrors do it again. They're, they are the most likely to beat the Thompson crew for the tag belts. They are the most likely. My style is Come on, Jet Set. Talk your talk. Let them boo you. Four star segment. Wow. There we go. Slugger Jones. Slugger Jones! And Grand Manga. I, I, I would like a slugger retained, to be honest. Yeah, that, that'll do. That'll do. Cruiserweight Classic is gonna have some. It's gonna have some bangers in there. It's gonna have some bangers. 
good matches, a nice plus for uh, for Jet on the mic, beautiful. We'll take the bonus. Week three, here we go. Right. Um, tag team, we know definitely Toxic Terrors are going to be there. Uh, Pay-per-view contenders match, TV title match, loads going on. Right, this is the rematch. Uh, he's not even on the list. He's not even on the list! Flawless, what happened? You're not injured, are you? No, no, he's there. Uh, this is... They've had a few matches, so we'll make this one a submission now. Something a bit special. Come back, come back, come back, come back. Feud is there. Lovely. Right, number one contenders match for the world title. This is a bit harder. I don't really know who to book. Dickie's the number one contender, but he's been beaten soundly. Rick is okay, but he's... He's a heel. Jet's a... A, a heel. It's like... Uh, Buzzsaw and Laser, I might have to use them for the tag team division. I'm so struggling so much to try and get those belts off the Thompsons. I might have to put them back together. Which means it's kind of it's kind of fresh, fresh time. So who has not had a world title match for a long time and possibly deserves it? Pierre did get a big win over Hooligan. I think we could do this. I think we could do that. What's what's uh, what's he done? He's lost a bustle in a singles. Uh, it, that probably doesn't merit it. Let's have a look at Pierre. I know he's won. He beat O'Hooligan. Lost a triple threat. Won a three man. Uh, what's the laser actually done? Laser. Lost to Dicky. Won the triple threat. Lost a triple threat. There's no one standing. I mean, Hammerhead did well recently. Slashmaster hasn't done anything. It's been weeks since we've seen him. Lost a tag match. Won a tag match. Lost a triple threat. Do you know what? Vader's doing all right. Vader's doing all right. Let's have a look at his recent. He lost to Dicky. Won a triple threat. Lost the world title match. Mm -hmm. This is hard. Do you know what? Let's let's look in the upper midsection and find two completely fresh contenders. We could go Arizona. We're going to leave the Van Winkles out. Dickie's had his time. Rick, what has Rick done? He lost the TV title triple threat, so yeah, we can't really put him in a world title match. Hammerheads, he's done all right. Lost to Zen, won the tag, won a tag. I mean, again, that's not world title. A big triple threat draw. Lost tag match, one tag match. We're really, actually, really struggling to find world title contenders. Can't use Okuda because he just lost to Pierre, which means I would have to put Pierre in. This is this is actually so hard. I I don't really know what to do. I didn't really know what to do. Did we dare go all the way down to mid card? We want to do Magnus. We want to do Magnus versus Slugger at some point. Putting him into the world title is a bit. It's a bit much. I'm actually torn. I'm actually torn here. Right. Okay. Okay, I don't know why it's taking me so long to book this world title match. I don't know what to do! I don't know what to do! Right. Buzz all laser, we're gonna use the tag division 100%. That's the job done. Um, which technically leaves. I mean, Ace has been. Ace has been terrible. I don't think we can merit him being in any sort of. Uh, sort of world title match. Couple things on the mic. Why? What a triple threat! What a triple threat! The problem is, he just never wins. He just never wins. Uh, what's Arizona been doing recently? What's he been doing? I'm just looking for fortune and glory. So we lost the flawless one in the singles. Promo draw. I mean, it's not really world title form. It should really be Pierre. Do you know what? It, it should be Pierre, shouldn't it? It really should. He beat a hooligan. He's one of the longest reigning champions of a while. Let's 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 put Pierre in there. 
beat Hooligan. Lost the triple threat though. Alright, oh, this is the one. This is the one. This is the one. Oh god, that took me ages. Why did it take me so long to book that world title match? Are we that are we struggling that much for people at the top of the card? Uh, this one should be more simple. We know for a fact it's gonna be uh, Toxic Terrors. If I can ever find them. We're not gonna use the Van Winkles because we're probably gonna use at least one of them in the Cruiserweight Cup. Uh, so let's just have a look, see if anyone jumps out as being particularly... I mean, wouldn't be a bad shout. Oh, we did say we were going to use the Blade Blasters, actually. I'll go on that. That's a banger. <laughs> That's a banger of a tag match, that is. Jeez. Right, and then a regular singles. We could do Magnus and Slugger here, but Slugger being a Cruiserweight Champion is a bit of a weird spot to have him. It's a bit of a weird spot. Oh, you know what? Let's do it. Because I'm just curious to see what the outcome's going to be. So we're going to go Magnus there. We're going to go Slugger here. I'm just curious, that's all. Cruiserweight champion versus one of the, you know, let's be fair, one of the best mid-carders we have. He's He's been in great form. Mike Spot, again, we're going to go back to the world champion. Because I don't think it was last week, was it? I took so long booking that that main event. I don't know how long ago that was. Mike, we want the eagle, don't we? Because he's got the, the two booster. We do. Oh no, we just yeah, they did just see this. So in that case, we will change that to. Let's let the let's let the dog talk. Let's let the dog talk. I really want him to do well, but he he just can't seem to win anything. I put him in. And then it's Canada time, I believe. Let's go. Oh my god. I Vince McMahon the booking on that world title match. Jeez. Banger of a match. They're still going. Ooh, Blade Blaster. Was not expecting that. Was not expecting that, not because it's not their foils and, uh, and Toxic Terrors have been doing good. I don't know if they're both world champions. Obviously, Buzzsaw has been. Has, Laser's been world champion, hasn't he? Must have been. I'll double check that. Here we go. I'm curious about this one. This was a weird one. We came up, came back during a skit. But I am intrigued. Ooh, Slugger Mine! Mm -mm, not during Cruiserweight Month. Not happening. Right, here we go. Number one contenders for the world title. Wow. Holy. Pierre does not lose often, and he certainly doesn't lose quick. Ah, Ace was hearing all the smack I was talking about him. Bring back the TV title, baby. We got a feud there for that, for that TV title. We got a feud. That's a lovely, that's a lovely little uh, section of matches there. Do you know we do? Or did I know? Laser and Jet Set. And now I've just put Jet Set, and I've just put Laser into the thing. I need to see if Laser's, Laser's won the world title. He, he, he has. He has, hasn't he? Laser. Yeah, 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 he did. Two defenses, one rain. Uh, won it from Slash Master and lost it to Slash Master. We need to do more with Slash Master, actually. So, we're going to have a tag team of two world champions. For the first time... Could be for the first time. Could be for the first time. Simple as that. Look at this. Looks lovely. Right, world title match. Ace versus Jet. Very strange. They were briefly... Um, briefly in a group together. We're just going to do a regular singles here. I'm not expecting... Honestly, I'm not expecting Jet to drop it. Ace... Has had a number of world title matches. Hannah has lost them all. Uh, TV title, tag title is simple. I think the Blades, they have a good chance. I still think Toxic Terrors are the one who will end up taking the belts off of them. 
uh, three person lady. So if we look, perhaps, I'm trying to find the ladies. Gothica's done well. So if we go with Gothica and Shipley, I think. Gothica, Shipley, and I think Elphet. That's probably our, our three hottest baby faces at the moment. And we're going to go with our heels. Uh, dollar, 100%. We need Queen. And we probably need Mother Russia. Russia, 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 Russia. Oh, how can we not book the women's champion, though? We'll, we'll, we'll give her a skit, let's say. Space Race will give us a little boost as well. That's lovely. And we will do the usual couple there. Beautiful. Beautiful. Right, so if we have a skit, we don't... Right. Cruiserweights. So we are going to go... Let's look at the Cruiserweight. Uh, Magna, Thunderbird. Thunderbird has to be in it. 100%. We're going to look for... Uh, Look for heels. I mean, hooligan. Do mm. we go hooligan? I don't think we do. Tweeners, we don't have any. We don't want too many baby faces, but it is what it is. I mean, we just have more baby face cruiserweights. I mean, it's, it just comes comes as simple as that. Do we have anyone injured that we really need to play? Let's have a quick look. Jesse is fine. Zen, one week. Ah, we can survive without Zen for a week. Yeah, 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 because we don't want him in the cruiserweight division anyway. Right. Dicky and Chameleon, I think. Gives Chameleon a good chance for a big upset. Uh, let's get a bit of money on this as well. Next up, we're going to go... Uh, Devon. I think Piranha. Devon and Piranha. Done. So we need... Make sure I'm not missing anyone we absolutely must have in here. Obviously Slugger. I think we get Warhawk. And Chet. Slugger will be this one. Do we do like the title rematch? But non title title rematch? Nah, he's already beaten him. He's already beaten him twice. But I feel like he's, he's a recent Cruiserweight champion, should really be in the tournament. So let's mix this around. Let's put. Yeah, let's put Magna there. Beautiful. Right, that's nice. Really good women's three-way, uh, three-person match. Tag team title match, world title match, merch table, let's go. All right, okay. All right. All right, that's done. Venue is going to be... Whew, rolling dice here. Olympus? No. Nope. It's going to be it's Silver Stadium. Here we go. Whew! It's taking me time today. Right, here we go. I'd like to see Chameleon do it, you know. As much as I want Thunderbird to bounce back, it would have been nice to see a little upset win there. Devin, multiple time Cruiserweight Champion. Piranha and OG, but it's been out of the game a little while. We could use a heel, really, but no, no, it's going to be... We're going to have Devin and Dicky in the next round. That's going to be interesting. Here we go, the... the, the the kind of three on three female tag. We've got a lot of contenders, former champions up there. Gothica, a win here would, you know, certainly keep her high. Shipley, ooh, Mother Russia says, mm -mm. three star, that's not bad. Right, here we go. Chet, poor Chet. Hasn't done 
done much. I just haven't done much with him. Neon, I've not been doing very well. Former champion. Goes through, possibly, to rematch with Slugger again. Warhawk and Slugger. Has to be Slugger, right? Has to be. This would be a massive upset if he lost. Not today. Not today. Right. Blade Blast. Blade Blaster, please. Someone needs to take the titles off of them. This is crazy. Oh my god, they didn't even try very hard. What the hell? It's definitely toxic terror next time. Definitely. Dicky Devon. Maybe Cruiserweight is Dicky's level. Maybe that's it. Maybe, you know, he's had a run for the world title. Maybe this is this is kind of his his peak. Right, come on, Slugger, you can do this. You can do this now. Don't let this man do this to you. Ooh, World Cruiserweight Champion has been defeated. Ace is not going to win. Ace is not going to win. He never wins. He's not going to win now. Never wins. Never wins. Never ever wins. I've given him so many chances and he never wins. Is it going to be Dicky or is it going to be Manga? <laughs> Dicky. This might just be his level. It might just be his level. The world title might just be might just be a bridge too far for Dicky. Are they were disqualified. Elfette maybe uh, getting his heel tendencies back. Slugger. Yeah. Ooh, injuries. The world champion was injured as well. Damn. All right. Well, there we go, people. I don't know what to do about the world title. We we need some people to stand up. I think Laser. I think we may, you know we gave we gave the Blade Blasters a go, but maybe it's time for Laser to come out. We'll see what happens. Hey, I'll catch you in October. Thank you for watching. Run the Legends. See you again. Peace.